Ariana Grande and SNL star Pete Davidson. Listen, thing. when you know, you know. That's what they say, Kim. Oh, okay, that's what it is. Okay. I guess so. But if you saw Pete on the Tonight Show last yeah. night, which is his first interview <laughs> since the engagement, well, you could tell even he was having a hard time believing it. Love I feel too. like I won a contest. <laughs> <laughs> so right, sick. How are you? How are you handling it all, right? Split, Jimmy. <laughs> En route to Fallon last night, Pete and Ariana enjoyed some lollipops outside their new $16 million, 4,000 square foot love nest in New York. A source confirmed to ET the 24 year olds are living together and are excited for the next chapter. Some dude came up to me, he was like, Yo, man, you like gave me hope. <laughs> The singer only went public with the SNL comedian 22 days before getting engaged with a $93,000 rock. Pete's taking his Mr. Ariana Grande status in stride. I'm forever like known as like her plus one. <laughs> I'm excited yeah. for him, whatever yeah. is going on. While Pete's SNL co-star Heidi Gardner, promoting season three of her animated Super Mansion series, played coy about Davidson's relationship to E.T., he and Ariana aren't the first romance inside 30 Rock. This fling that I had with a guy on the show back then. Emma Stone joked about it, but a source confirmed to E.T. she did start casually dating the show's writer-director Dave McGarry last year. We're told they're still together. Also going strong, Scarlett Johansson and Weekend Update host Colin Jost. No, she's the best. A couple for over a year now, they've hit up several red carpets. Meanwhile, Ben Affleck and SNL producer Lindsay Shookus are also on full display. The pair of one year was seen having dinner this week in L.A. The source tells E.T. they're very much in love, but Ben isn't ready to propose. What's in the water at SNL? All I've seen in the water is lemon. I guess it's good.